Hi. Let's learn about the half-year convention for depreciation, which allows for the treatment of all property acquired during the year as being acquired in the middle of the year. The half-year convention for depreciation is the depreciation schedule that treats all property acquired during the year as being acquired exactly in the middle of the year. This means that only half of the full-year depreciation is allowed in the first year, while the remaining balance is deducted in the final year of the depreciation schedule or the year that the property is sold. The matching principle seeks to match expenses to the period in which the related revenues were earned. Depreciation is an accounting convention that helps match expenses incurred by a fixed asset and the related revenues generated by that asset over its useful life. An item is recorded as a fixed asset at the time of purchase if it exceeds a capitalization threshold and will bring value to the company over a number of years. Depreciation allows a company to expense a portion of the cost of an asset in each of the years of the asset's useful life, keeping track of the book value of the asset by subtracting the accumulated depreciation from the asset's historical cost. For example, if a company purchases a delivery truck in July, the half-year convention expenses half of the calculated depreciation expense in year 1, and the remaining balance is deducted in years 2 through 10, with the final portion in year 11. This ensures a more accurate matching of expenses to revenues over the truck's useful life. The half-year convention can be applied to all property except residential rental property, non-residential real property, railroad gratings, and tunnel bores, unless the mid-quarter convention applies. The half-year convention can be used if the mid-quarter convention does not apply, which occurs if the aggregate basis of property placed in service during the last three months of the tax year exceeds 40% of the aggregate basis of all property placed in service during the tax year. Here are three key takeaways. 1. The half-year convention for depreciation takes one-half of the typical annual depreciation expense in both the first and last years of an asset's useful life. Two. The purpose of the half-year convention is to better align expenses with revenues generated by the asset in the same accounting period, per the matching principle. 3. The half-year convention applies to all forms of depreciation, including straight-line, double-declining balance, and some of the year's digits. Hope this would help, thanks for watching.